everyone, so this week it was meant to be sports day, so I've set you an athlete's challenge. This week I want you all to perform a pentathlon. A pentathlon is made up of five events. It's going to include running, jumping and throwing. So I'm going to show you how to do them and then you can get on with it. Okay, so event one is the shuttle run. You will need a tape measure and some objects to mark out where you need to run between. So first you need to mark out five meters and then you are going to do your shuttle runs and run backwards and forwards 20 times. This is also known as 100 meters. Event two is the stand in long jump. So again, you will need an object to mark your starting point and an object to hold whilst you jump to mark where you have landed. You will also need a tape measure so that you can measure how far you jump. Go. Event three is the stand in vertical jump. You will need something to mark the wall. It could be a sticker, some tape or some chalk and a tape measure to measure the difference between your standing touch and how high you can jump. Okay, so what you want to do first is stand close to a wall and you want to reach up as high as you can and mark where that is. Then you want to step a little bit further away from the wall, swing your arms back, jump as high as you can and mark the wall with your other piece of tape. You need to then get an adult or someone taller than you to measure the difference between this mark and the one that I'm about to do. <laughs> Event four is the speed bounce. You will need an object that you'll be having to jump over. So you place the object down on the floor and you need to get somebody to time you for 20 seconds and you need to jump backwards and forwards making sure you're staying nice and controlled and you are landing on both feet each side. Event five is the target throw. So you will need something soft. I've got three pairs of socks. You'll also need a box of some sort that will be your target. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to measure out three meters and that's where I'm going to stand to throw my socks into the target. Yes! And just remember, if it's too easy, move some of the targets back. And if it's too challenging, move yourself a little bit closer. I hope you enjoy. And if you want to share any of your results with us, just email them to the school email address. Bye.